Well, kids across our area will be heading back to school in a few weeks, but with school shootings and gun violence becoming more commonplace, parents now have to worry if their kids will come home from class safely. One South Carolina County is taking a really big step to ease or at least try to ease some of those concerns. Chesterfield County is adding an extra level of security by putting metal detectors in their seven middle and high schools. NBC Charlotte's Chloe Leshner is in Chesterfield County with more on why this decision was made. In two weeks, middle and high schoolers in Chesterfield County will be walking through these metal detectors. School officials say it's a sign of the times. It's a story we've heard too many times. A gun in a school, students' lives at risk. It's heartbreaking to know these things are happening throughout the United States. Uh, even here in South Carolina, the Chesterfield but, um, County Sheriff trying to, trying to prevent that, pushing for these metal detectors. In the next few days, they'll be moved to the entrances of every middle and high school in the county. Safety is the priority, uh, and the reality is that uh, students can't learn until they have a strong sense of uh, feeling safe. They won't be on every single day, and some of them are mobile and can be used at sporting events. The sheriff's office raised tens of thousands of dollars to cover the cost. The school district kicking in some money, too. You can't put a price on our kids' safety. It's the first school in our area to take this step. Lancaster County schools have mobile metal detectors, and Clover schools will now have them at their football stadium. CMS has wrestled with the idea, but for now uses wands. We want students to feel safe. We want students to feel secure. Uh, we want them to know that school is a safe haven for them. The sheriff says he hopes one day metal detectors will be in every school in the county and that other districts will follow suit. In Chesterfield County, Chloe Leshner, NBC Charlotte.